come down here every year for this fun in the sun. The outpouring of just the friend, friendly people that are here, it's just in this area, it's just fantastic. There's still time to have fun in Grants Pass this weekend for the 61st annual Boatnik Festival. While the festival did have a mix of weather over the weekend, vendors say that hasn't stopped business from booming. You take the good with the bad, you can't have it perfect all the time. Regardless of uh, the weather, you know, we got a lot of people coming out here supporting everybody. Students from Grants Pass High School Dance and Guard Team were splashing their way into the festival, all to raise funds for their school program. The water is really, really cold, but it's for a good cause. With dozens of vendors selling food, merchandise and activities for everyone, Organizers say they expect to see around 400,000 people to walk through the streets of Riverside Park over the long weekend. They say 100% of the proceeds from the festival go right back to the community. With all the fun and celebrations lasting through Memorial Day, the meaning behind the holiday isn't forgotten. To me, it's, it's all about remembering those that went before us. Veterans Day is for those that are still uh, serving, but this is for those that went before us, and we can't honor them enough. In Grants Pass, Ray Van Vors, NBC5 News. And like Ray Van said, you still have one day left to enjoy the Boatnik festivities. Tomorrow, Memorial Day, the carnival will open at 9 a.m., followed by a service at noon. The festival will end with the Tom Rice Memorial Hydroplane Race, which starts at 1 p.m.